What I'm saying to you is this. Mike Tannenbaum is not qualified to make football decisions. Oh, boy. He's qualified to make cap decisions. Mm -hmm. He's not qualified to make football decisions. Rex Ryan is not qualified to be a head coach because he doesn't have the big picture point of view. He neglects his offense. The evidence is there before our very eyes. Rex Ryan is a defensive coordinator, one of the best, but that's what he is. He had an opportunity to evolve, to grow, to mature. He didn't do it. He wanted to focus on his defense and ride its coattails and look where it got him. So you have a head coach who doesn't need to be in that position. You have an offensive coordinator who doesn't need to be in that position. You have a GM who does not need to be in that position. What more do you want me to say? If that ain't cleaning house, I don't know what it is. I've said it. I've alluded to it before. I'm going to say it again right here on national television for everybody to hear. Bill Polian. The architect, the man that was in. I know that some people in Indy might have problems with him. I don't. His reputation is pretty damn impressive to me, okay? In terms of him building a team, b g drafting football players, building, a, I'm talking about meshing together yeah. parts that actually work. This is a football man. I'm Woody Johnson. I clean house. I bring in Bill Polian, and I hire that man, and I say, what you want us to do with Mark Sanchez? What do you want us to do? Because to me, you need a football person in there. That's what you need. And you need somebody that knows how to have the right personnel, your scouts, people that's going to – because think about it. What have the Jets done in terms to build a team? Yeah. What young talent do they, they really have? They call it fast They food. have been – it's fast food. That's, what, that's, that's exactly what, what Trent doing. So the fast yeah. food and, and, you know, build your gut ultimately. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. That's what it does. But it does, it does nothing for stamina. It does nothing for longevity. It does nothing to really, really elevate you to another level. You need to have a football man in there. And if it's not Bill Polian, somebody of that quality to come in there and make sure he picks – the head coach and from that point on they decide what they need to do with Sanchez you do it quick fast and in a hurry mm -hmm. because clearly what you have in place is awful it needs to go Pullian's on our team though I don't want to lose it <laughs> you know we're advocating that we're going to lose him you know what yeah, well, I, I love him but but we'll be fine without him the Jets need him more desperately than we do and we need we need him and we love him mm -hmm. but the Jets are, they are in a very abysmal state of affairs. They need somebody of that quality. You have been consistent about Tannenbaum from about week four on. So I applaud you for that. I laud you for that. And, and that would be, that's where you need to start with the fix. Now, I'm again going to disqualify myself. I'm very down on Rex Ryan. I like him personally, but so I, do I. I, I believe he duped and misled my guy Tebow from the start. I think he... He gave Tebow the, the feeling that he was going to get a real shot at winning the quarterback job, which was bogus. It, it was never there at all. And yet, I must say, and I stick by this opinion, there's no better defensive mind in football than Rex Ryan. Right. For the sake of the Jets, I would hate for them to lose that. Because even last night, Stephen A., they hung in there defensively, and they don't have Revis. And they're down a couple players here and there, and they just hang in and hang in because he can just flat out call defense. They're blitzing from everywhere. Jake Locker didn't know what had hit him half the time. So the point is, do you want that? Do you want to dismiss that? Because I'm not sure about that yet. I'm, I'm not sure you want to lose that. And and with Sanchez, so you're going to owe him a little over 17 million against the well, cap he, he's in a, 2013. He's 17 million against yeah. the cap, 8.25 million in salary. Okay, he, here's the point. I'm a Tebow guy. But Tebow was the monkey wrench here. You know, he, he, he was the, you, you know, you, you dropped the Tebow bomb on that locker room back in training camp, right? If, if you free Tebow, that's hashtag free Tebow, mm -hmm. all of a sudden you clear the deck for Sanchez. You, you do. I, I, I'm not, I'm not going to dismiss what could be Sanchez because I've seen him play pretty well. He had a couple of moments this year. Against Indianapolis, they played pretty well. That opener against Buffalo, mm -hmm. and then they went to St. Louis. He played pretty well. Mm -hmm. I saw flashes of the, the two-year-ago, three-year-ago Sanchez. Mm -hmm. Yeah? You're talking to a native New Yorker here. Mm -hmm. We're done with him. Okay. We're done with Can him. Can you speak for the whole collective yeah, yeah, Jets yeah, fandom? Yeah, yes, yes. Okay. We're done with him. It's over. Okay, In other you, words, you realize how to, you're going to cripple your here's, cap here's here? Here's what I'm trying to tell you. Here's what I'm trying to tell you. This is why Sanchez has to go. He won't get any breaks. Mm. 
New Yorkers will be hell-bent on making his life miserable. He can't walk the streets. He can't go into a restaurant without getting heckled. He can't park his car without the valet looking for an extra tip just to be associated with his car, let alone him. It's that bad. I mean, I'm trying to tell you, it's bad. So he it's, needs bodyguards. It's, it's, it is yeah. bad. Yep. He is persona non grata. He is, we are done with mm -hmm. him, okay? Because this dude is just awful. I'm talking about mental. One of the things, understand something here about New Yorkers. We can't stand mentally weak dudes. Weak. Weak. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about, listen, do we have that sound from Steve Young? Mm -hmm. With Steve Young talking about how, you know, you're accelerating downward. Do we have that sound? If we do, we don't have, we it. Don't have it. Steve Young was talking Good, about it. I want to hear you. <laughs> Steve Young was talking about it last night. He said you, he does nothing to stop the bleeding. He does nothing to sit there and parachute it, to offset it. He said he's spiraling. He's, he's literally just regressing. He's going downhill. He's accelerating. His exact words is accelerating downhill. Skip, you can't have that. What happens is this. New Yorkers are looking at him, and the slightest mistake that occurs is his fault. We're not cutting him a break, right, wrong, or otherwise. We're done with him. We're done. Okay. He needs to go away. Okay, so here's your option. If you're saying do away with Tannenbaum or move him upstairs, whatever you're going to do. He's a cap, cap, cap dude. Just, okay. just get him away from making football decisions. Fire Rex, fire Sperano, you're saying dismiss Sanchez. Just cut him. Send him on his way. Obviously, Tebow's going to be sent on his way. Clear the decks. You know what you got next year? Yeah, you're just kind of starting over. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. How is that worse? Because the fact of the matter is you are the one. You pointed out how, excuse me, the defensive personnel, oh, got, by the way, you see what the defense has done? Darrell Revis mm -hmm. would be back. Bam. They'll be okay. Number two, offensively, look at what they have. You have no choice but to start over. Mark Sanchez has 50 turnovers in two years. Yeah. Mark Sanchez has spiraled downward. He's plummeted. He's crashed. Mm -hmm. Okay? Where are you going? It doesn't matter anyway. you talking about right, right now, Greg McElroy should be in the star lineup. And Skip, do you think mentally Sanchez can uh, rebound? Well, you, you're fairly new to the show. I, I have been all over that for yeah. a long time on this show. You said it. He has no backbone. Yeah. But he does have some talent, and he I'm had not one. He does it. He, he had one four I, road I, playoff I, game. I'm, Think about that. Four I road am playoff not saying games. That the man has not no talent. easy to do. I'm not saying. But when you are mentally weak, weak. to begin with, mm -hmm. then once demoralization kicks in. You're finished where you are. Tebow yeah. crushed him this year. He could not take the looming presence if you of the that, force of competitive if you believe nature. That, if you believe that, another executive will. Maybe mm -hmm. they'll take him off your hands. Take who off? Sanchez. Oh, Sanchez. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, he would get, he'd get a job. All right.